I like a small mouth. Shut up! Cartoons! It's fun! It's learning! But most of all, it's just shut up. Hi, shut up! Hi, I'm Andy! Yay. And say hi to the beautiful but hard to contact after work, Miss Wendy! Yeah. Uh, Mr. Squirrel got caught in traffic, but he'll be here soon, kiddos. Yeah. He's not even here yet. But right now, what I want to do is to introduce you to somebody extra special. Somebody who's going to talk to you about something really important that maybe you don't know about. Let's say a big happy hello to our new friend, Miss Manners. Mm -mm. <clears throat> saying please and thank you will get you far, but saying gimme and mine will leave a scar. I'm Miss Manners. My mother was the original Miss Manners, and the one thing she always strictly drilled onto us was no eating on the toilet unless it was a holiday. Now I want to talk to you all today about something very awkward. It's something that you should never talk about. Not with your friends, not with your family, because if you do, you will get called terrible names like slut or pervy man bimbo. That is right, I'm talking about sex. S-E-X. Now here are the lessons you need to know. Sex is bad. And you shouldn't do it unless you're in a really strong relationship and you're at least two years sober. Okay, kiddos? You get that? Now repeat after me. I will never Hey, ever... kiddos! Don't repeat after Andy. Yeah. Well, all right, just let them make their own drunk mistakes. Great. But always use protection. Okay. Oh, 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 who's the new girl? Hey. Oh, I'm Miss Manners. Miss Manners? Total job face. Am I right? Miss Manners. Uh-huh. Did you get my nut off? Um. Go ahead, grab it. Grab it, take it off. Okay. I like your small mouth. I'm 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 not a I'm not a woman, Mr. School. I can I can be into that. When in Rome. It's time for a cartoon, kids! Yay! Please please take your nut back. What is wrong, my lotus blossom? Nothing, Dad. Nothing. Amazing! Are you always she's dead? Yes! You have dishonored my daughter via the seductive art of sexting. And now you must pay! I didn't even want those pictures! I wish I could unsee the things I've seen. 
Your lies only make my soul the thirstier for your blood! Are you serious? Please! How did I suffer enough? You have a point. <laughs> what soul does my blade? Battle Bobby Johnson! Power level pain! Bobby Johnson. Haha, <laughs> uh, we've got a real sexpert here today to teach you kiddos the right and wrong things about the human mating process. Hello, kids at home. First question. Does it hurt? I think that it kind of depends on the person. Have you ever, uh, you know, um, you know. You're gonna have to be a lot more specific. What is space docking? It kind of depends on the person. How many dates do you go on before you can get busy? I don't know. I've never f***ed a giraffe. Bed or jungle gym? Well, the jungle gyms that they have now are very padded and have lots of foam covering all of the scary metallic bars but it has a lot to do with being with somebody that you trust and you can communicate that to. What's in the box? Oh, Gorgonzola, the best of all cheeses. Sexy answer. Have you ever been arrested? All over the Southeastern United States. Perfect. <laughs> and my knees were jelly. See kids, sex isn't that scary. Almost everyone does it, including that chubby lady who works at the grocery store. And it blew my mind. Uh, here's another cartoon. Hey, is teenagers! The boys at school are immature. If you want a real boyfriend, you're gonna have to broaden your scope. He wants to know your bra size. <laughs> I don't know what my bra size is. I don't even wear a bra. Pubertina, like if you took your mom's boobs, added them to my mom's boobs, divided them by two, stuffed them into two different cups, and then say, put a bandage on them, I would say they, well, uh, let's just say still growing. Okay, you take over. He wants to know what I'm wearing. He really appreciates those small details. I bet he is handsome. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy! Oh, this is, this is exciting. I'm excited. Do you feel excited? I, I, yeah, I just feel so excited. Has anything so exciting ever happened in your life, Debs? Uh, no, uh, no it hasn't. I'm gonna get a boyfriend and then maybe get my first kiss and maybe he won't mind my pimples because maybe he likes pimples. Who knows? Who knows? That's is a desert scape or... Oh, just yeah. disgusting. Puberty, no. Hold me. It's okay, hold Debs. Me, hold it's me, gonna be hold. okay. No, no, we'll get over no. it. Time. That's what it looks like now! Oh. Gross! <laughs> Have you ever been boy crazy, Miss Wendy? Yeah, in high school I had this boyfriend and he had beautiful eyes. Hey, no one wants to hear that! Oh, come on, TMI! Yeah. There are children here. What? No one wants to hear about your love life, Miss Wendy. I mean, honestly, that's incredibly inappropriate. I didn't expect that from her. You know, I mean, there, there are children right there. Beautiful, innocent little children. And she's going on about all the dick she had in high school. I'm really sorry you had to hear that, kiddos, but guess what? It's time for the Magic Mirror! Yay! When Andy looks through the mirror, he can see you and me. Hey, Andy, look through the mirror. Let's hear what you can see. Well, I see Lewis at home in Kentucky. 
and Lewis is downloading dirty whale pics. That makes me frown. Lewis, you're only eight, and whales shouldn't be objectified. I see Carrie in Morrow Bay. Carrie's doing naughty things with her teddy bear. Please don't do that, Carrie. Oh, oh, and I think we have time for one more. Who, who do, who do I see? Oh, I see, oh, I see Miss Wendy's high school boyfriend. <gasps> He is fat and ugly, and he is watching kids shows. Pathetic. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, what is that? He's saying something. He's saying it's, it's really time for you to move on and to consider getting involved with one of your coworkers. The one, wait, wait, the one without a criminal record. Hmm. Does Andy really see all that? The magic mirror never lies. Look at that last part. Time for a cartoon! Yeah! You sure you'll be fine without me tonight? You just better be home on time, otherwise you're gonna have to sleep on the futon. But that's where we always sleep. Not our bedroom futon, the futon in the living room. I can understand the confusion though, as all the furniture in our house is made by the fine people over at the Futon Corporation. Can I get a kiss goodbye? Damn straight. Mmm. Ah. Uh. Bye, Rusty. Where's Krista going? Man, she's got some girls night out or some shit. Don't matter though, I can take care of myself. Oh, did you get a microwave burrito? No man, I mean I can take care of myself. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about masturbation. It's the safest sex around. I never got my hand pregnant. Could you imagine? Like another finger grows in? We're talking penthouse, believe it or not, top shit right there, partner. Smart. I come from generations and generations of masturbators. I don't even know how anybody was born. You know what I'm saying? I guess some lady, say my grandma Dorothy. Uh, she's sweet. I guess she must accidentally like slip in a puddle of spilled seed or some shit and splashed up in there. You know what I'm saying? And boom, another generation was born. She makes the best cherry cobbler. But like I was saying, I'm from a long line of masturbators. I do it to internet webcam models. My dad did it to like dirty movies. My dad's dad did it to magazine. My dad's dad dad did it to sexy Morse code messages. My dad's 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 dad did it to like the cotton gin. My dad's 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 dad did it to like the pyramids in Egypt. That shit look like the Madonna tatas. And my dad's 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 dad probably masturbated to fire. Sexy ass fire dancing around all warm and I'm back. What? You just left? Nuh-uh, Rusty. I was gone for five hours. I seemed like no more than five minutes. Oh, were you talking about masturbating again? Yes. Yeah, maybe. You know how you lose track of time when you're talking about touching yourself. All 2009 is a blur. No! Hey, shut up! I hope you kiddos learned a lot about S-E-X today. But most importantly, I hope you learned that it's something that I'll never talk to you about ever again. Seriously, just ask your parents about it. This is really not my area of expertise. There's a ton of good links on the internet. Just make sure you turn the volume all the way down. If you kids at home want to join us here, collect the UPC codes from any 12-pack of cowboy condoms. They're the sponsor of the show today. That's all for now. See you next time. I wear cowboy condoms. Gross. Yeah. I'm wearing one right now. Really gross. Thank <laughs> you.